from age-old crocodiles to the oldest living tortoises, here are the 12 biggest reptiles in the animal kingdom. Number 12. Galapagos Tortoise It's time to pay our respects to one of the senior citizens of the reptilian family. In fact, these gentle creatures are among the longest living beings on the planet. Say hello to the Galapagos Tortoise. These herbivorous gentle giants can weigh up to 400 pounds and can grow as long as 5 feet. Even more impressive, they can grow almost 3 feet tall. Incredible, isn't it? And that's not the specialty of these fellows. They can live well over a hundred years. And sometimes, the oldest ones are believed to be over 150 years old. Judging by their looks, you'd think that it's their shell that is super heavy, right? Wrong. It's made out of an advanced honeycomb-like structure to be ultra strong yet lightweight. And did you know what? These guys are among the first species that were studied by Charles Darwin back in the 1800s. He even took one of them as a pet. And not so surprisingly, the pet tortoise outlived him and his children. However, it is sad to know that these happy, relaxed animals are now endangered because of deforestation, loss of habitat, and human activities. We need to be careful, or we'll soon make them extinct. Number 11. Green Sea Turtle Here is another contender for the biggest and longest living tortoises. This is the iconic Green Sea Turtle. Now, obviously, you should be thinking that these fellows should look green since their names imply that, right? Nope, not necessarily. Not all green sea turtles are green. Now, these sea-dwelling giants can grow up to 420 pounds and can grow as long as 4 feet. Their diet is vegetarian only, and these turtles live in various tropical and subtropical coastal waters around the world. But it is heartbreaking to know that they are endangered, primarily because of human activities and specifically global warming. But did you know what? They too can live well over a hundred years, and they simply love water. They spend almost 90% of the time in the water, often only leaving to lay eggs. Sadly, many times, most of the babies die before reaching adulthood, either from being eaten by other creatures or from not making it to the ocean to feed before running out of energy. Number 10, Loggerhead Sea Turtle. Now here is a bit of a tough fellow. Why would I say that? Because these guys are primarily carnivorous and can get mean and ugly sometimes. Meet the Loggerhead Sea Turtle. Ever wondered why they are called Loggerhead? Look for yourself. The sturdy, oversized head looks like a log, right? Besides, don't you think it really makes them look tougher and less friendly? These macho animals can weigh up to 450 pounds, but guess what? They only grow as long as three and a half feet. Yes, apart from weight, in size, they appear smaller than their tortoise and turtle counterparts. Although they are not renowned for living long, they are avid travelers. Lady loggerhead sea turtles return to the beaches they were hatched at to lay their own eggs, sometimes crossing thousands of miles of ocean to get there. Yes, thousands of miles. Loggerheads are known for their ability to migrate vast distances. And here's a fact. Because of their color shading and juxtaposition, loggerhead sea turtles are among the most beautiful creatures out there in the ocean. And by the way, are there any other beautiful turtles you know of? Have you ever found a turtle yourself? Perhaps it was in the deep grass near a small river or stream, or in the reeds at the edge of a pond? Growing up, one of the most exciting things that can happen is finding a tiny animal out in the wild. I hope you left it alone, or at least put it back after investigating it a little bit. Let me know about your experience finding small reptiles or amphibians in the comments below. Then be sure to subscribe if you haven't already for more awesome videos coming out very, very soon. Number 9. Reticulated Python Among the other big reptiles out there in the world, it's clear that some of our crawling friends deserve a mention as well. Please meet the longest living snake in the world, the Reticulated Python. The Reticulated Python is indigenous to the rainforests in Southeast Asia and are among the largest snake species on the planet. As the name suggests, they are pythons, so naturally they are non-venomous. But don't get it wrong, it doesn't make them any less deadly. 
reaching a weight of almost 250 to 300 pounds, they can grow as long as 35 feet. Yes, that makes them the longest species of snakes out there. Apart from their size, they are known for their striking and vibrant coloration. They come in a variety of colors, ranging from gold and olive to even black or dark green. These fellows hunt alone and can be fatally aggressive if provoked. Let's hope you'd never come across a real one now or you'd be in serious trouble. Number eight, Aldabra giant tortoise. Meet yet another long living cousin of the Galapagos tortoise, the Aldabra giant tortoise. Is it just me? Or does that fanciful name rhyme with abracadabra? Abracadabra aldabra. Now, these fellows can weigh almost 450 pounds and can grow as long as four and a half feet. Aldabra giants are native to Aldabra Island and the surrounding islands, including Madagascar, Mauritius, and Reunion Islands. These majestic giants usually feed off vegetation, yet they are known to eat smaller animals, especially invertebrates. Here's something funny. Animal behavioral scientists have noticed that they are almost completely uninterested in humans and love to spend time and socialize with their other tortoise buddies. To be fair, if I were a giant tortoise, I would hope that I'd know well enough to leave those strange two-legged hairless apes alone. Human beings are always bothering animals who don't want the attention. Number seven, green anaconda. Behold the largest snake in the world. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the anaconda. Did you know that this massive animal can weigh a staggering 500 pounds? That's almost twice as much as the second largest snake on the planet, the reticulated python. And guess what? They can grow as long as 30 feet. And if you thought that, like most animals in the world, the males were larger than the females, the green anaconda would be the exception. In fact, the female anacondas are larger and heavier than the males, often by several feet and several dozens of pounds. However, these Hollywood mega monsters are known as ferocious man-eaters, who go on a rampage terrorizing people, right? Wrong. In reality, anacondas are not man-eaters and disengage around humans. Anacondas are solitary ambush predators. They hunt alone and often wait silently until some poor tiny creature happens upon them and strike them with lightning speed and squeeze the prey until it suffocates. And what's next? They swallow the prey completely whole. Yep, their tummy is big and stretchy enough to accommodate anything they want to swallow. This includes deer, turtles, big fish, and even crocodiles. Number six, Parsons Chameleon. Now, I believe that every reptile deserves an equal opportunity, at least almost everyone. That's why there has to be consideration given to the biggest chameleon in the world, Parsons Chameleon. Now, in a certain way, these animals have made it to the Hollywood screen too. Can you guess where? Have you ever watched the movie Madagascar? Yes, these guys are there. Parsons Chameleon can grow up to 27 inches long and can weigh almost two pounds. Well, looking at all the other massive reptiles, it doesn't mean much, but this guy is the largest chameleon in the world and deserves to be discussed rather than kept in the shadows. Just like all the other chameleons, they can change the color of their skin to adjust to the surroundings. And although they are slow movers, they can be super fast if they ever feel threatened. Here's a fun fact. You thought this guy was long for his species, right? Guess what? The Parsons chameleon's tongue is twice the length of its body. It can use its long tongue to strike insects from afar and reel them back in. Now that's what I call long range. Number five, American alligator. Now it's time to examine someone who has walked this earth, or rather swam it for almost 150 million years, the American alligator. A typical American alligator can weigh about 800 pounds and can get as long as 13 feet. These carnivorous mega monsters live as freshwater dwellers and can be mainly found in the regions of the Southeast United States, especially in Louisiana and Florida. They are the biggest reptiles in the United States. Although they are incredibly big, these fellows are solitary stealth predators. While in the water, they look almost identical to floating logs. Here's an interesting fact. 
American alligators have lived side by side with their distant cousins, the dinosaurs, for many millions of years, and even survived the meteor that wiped them out. Now that's what I call a survivor. Speaking of interesting stuff, haven't you subscribed to The Biggest yet? Go ahead, click the bell button, and tag along. New videos are coming out all the time. Number 4. Gariel. Now, once you see this guy, the first question that will pop out is, how on earth could even its mother love this ugly creature? Yes, the same thing ran through my head. Meet the Gariel. The Gariel, also known as Gaviel, can weigh between 550 and 820 pounds. It can grow to a length of between 11 and a staggering 17 feet. Now that is big. But the most noticeable thing about the Gariel is not its size. It's the big, mushroom-like growth at the tip of its snout. This growth is only visible in males and not in females. In fact, it's the only crocodile species that has such a visible physical distinction between the gents and the ladies. Why is it that even in strange animal species, it's the females that always look just a bit more put together and aesthetic? You should be wondering why the males possess such a strange growth, right? As it turns out, its purpose is romance. Yes, when nearing the mating season, the male gharials would use this to blow bubbles and to make a showy display to attract the females. How on earth can someone fall for something like that? Another special fact about these fellows is that they are not stealthy predators like other crocs. Its unique snout contains extremely sensitive cells that can pick up the slightest vibration in the water, and once its prey is close enough, the gharial strikes fast and grabs it. Number 3. Leatherback Sea Turtle Behold the biggest sea turtle there is, the Leatherback Sea Turtle. On average, these guys can weigh somewhere between 550 pounds and 1,320 pounds. And know how long they can get? Almost six and a half feet. These guys are not so gentle giants, and they are mostly carnivorous. A typical diet includes jellyfish and other soft-bodied small creatures. And, unlike other reptiles, these turtles have unique biological adaptations that allow them to go for much colder waters. They aren't confined to tropical and subtropical zones. They can go all over the ocean and compete with many of the toughest species in the world for food. And guess what? They are the oldest known turtle species in the world. Number 2. Nile Crocodile Now it's time to take a look at the big guns. Coming in at number 2 is the Nile Crocodile. These crocs are legendary for their super strong bite force as they have the strongest bite force out of any living animal on the planet. They can weigh up to 1,650 pounds and stand a striking 12 to 18 feet long. These carnivorous mega hunters can be found in Africa, along the Nile River, and in Madagascar as well. Another special thing about them is that they are not greedy meat eaters. Once they hunt, they leisurely eat their meal at a slow pace. They know how to savor their food, unlike most animals. I guess that's what happens when you're the apex predator. No one dares mess with you while you're eating. Now that's what I call table manners. Number 1. Saltwater Crocodile Ladies and gentlemen, we are about to see the biggest living reptile on the planet. This is the big, bad, and deadly saltwater crocodile weighing almost 2,200 pounds and growing up to lengths of 13 to 19 feet, these mega creatures are the biggest reptiles to walk the earth since their extinct cousins, the dinosaurs. They are well distributed among several regions around the world, starting from eastern India, southeast Asia, and well into northern Australia. Like many of their cousins, these guys are stealthy hunters too. Saltwater crocs are usually known to avoid humans rather than confronting us. But when they do, the outcomes are usually menacing for the people, and sometimes they can be extremely aggressive towards people that violate their territory. Now listen to this. The mother saltwater crocs are known for being protective moms for their kids. I'm not joking. They lay about 50 eggs at a time and watch over the eggs and the baby crocs carefully 
for the first few months of their lives. Even the most dangerous reptiles have the same maternal instinct as humans, except for their giant jaws, sharp claws, and ability to thrive in saltwater environments, we're not so different after all. And that's all for today, folks. Stay tuned and subscribe to The Biggest for more videos just like this. And remember, don't forget to comment your thoughts down below too with any suggestions you have for future videos. It's the viewers who make it all worthwhile. Until next time!